I had a mother who was unbelievably optimistic. This sort of unfailing belief in you that, you know, everything's possible. I think parents can do that. We've all benefited from other people watching out for us. That's why we serve. UCLA's three missions are teaching, research, and service. There's a larger sense to serve as to be dedicated to our community. One volunteer project that I'm particularly fond of is our efforts to help the VA campus, which is right beside us, just west of UCLA. So I do have a number of members of my family that had served. I understood some of the struggles, but also how important it is to be able to provide some support to these individuals who have given so much to the country. The Veterans Justice Clinic is a course that's affiliated with the Veterans Legal Clinic. We teach students skills, and those skills are applied through their casework in the clinic. We had a client, he's a veteran, he became homeless and he was living out of a vehicle. And the reason why he could not get a job is because he did not have a driver's license and he did not have a permanent home address. Someone can end up in a situation where they have a ticket that started out maybe like $120, and if they don't take care of it right away, it's like $1,500, maybe even $2,000 or $3,000. So he didn't have the ability to pay the tickets, and we were able to successfully get all three of them dismissed, and now he was able to go to the DMV and get his license back, which was one huge barrier to him getting his life back together. Education is the most hopeful space I know of. That place in our society where we think, how are we going to make the world a better place? It's through schooling. So in 2007, our chancellor started his tenure at UCLA, and one of his first acts was to start the UCLA Community School. Incredibly brave move. Very visionary. So students as young as five had been bussed out across the entire city, and now they wake up and walk to school completely historic. This serves the community and it says the new CLA is here. We're going to help you. I think that we're changing lives. My parents are awesome people. We had a responsibility to be our best, to use that to help someone else. As a public institution, it's our responsibility to make sure that students from all communities, all backgrounds, geographies, abilities, every child deserves an opportunity to be prepared for, go to, and graduate from college. And that means we have to be in the community. It's important to understand that the work that we do goes beyond an eight to five. It is a purpose. So if we don't achieve our mission, none of us are gonna live in the kind of society that we want to be a part of. These are our young people, our neighbors, our communities. So whether I'm in the grocery store or whatever that is, I cannot see young people without talking to them about education. My staff and my colleagues here are the same way. I'm happy to see the fruits of our labor, but we have so much more work to do. I believe tomorrow will be a better day, next week will be a better week, and a better month, and a better year. We're gonna to continue to make a difference in the lives of young people. Our labor is going to pay off. Journalism, whether it was as a clerk at the New York Times out of college or as the reporter for the LA Times or as the editor of Blueprint. For me, it's about the search for ideas that work in society. It's attempting to get real answers to, to actual problems uh, and then let policymakers chew on them. One of the defining facts of the city is the absence of things that pull it together. It's much more defined by what spreads it apart. Blueprint has always been about connecting people and ideas with one another, but it also is literally meant to bring people together. UCLA is, as a public institution in a place with crying public need, has a responsibility to improve life here. It's uniquely positioned to do that. This is a credible, nonpartisan, public-oriented institution that can convene conversations and bring together those who need and those who have something to offer. So all of that is something UCLA can do, and therefore it's something that UCLA must do. And happily, it is something that UCLA does do.
Um, so one of our biggest um, recurring programs is called One Bus, One Cause. We rent out one bus, and for that day, we'll go to only one service organization. It's very lively, even though it's really early in the morning. Everyone's working towards that same thing. What you feel like when you come out to a One Bus, One Cause, when you're at volunteer day working with those other UCLA students, it's just been so powerful, and it's a sight to see. So as I think about the past hundred years, the entire university is focused on public service. That's what really has defined UCLA, of having tremendous impact in Los Angeles and throughout the state. We're also to the nation and even to the world. As I think about the next hundred years, I am really optimistic. <laughs>